Again, I, I will ask you maybe one more question just about the Sanson. And it has this incredible reputation. It is the, the piece you think about. Um, is that because there's just not a lot of other pieces like that? Is it just a superb, I shouldn't say, is it a superb piece? Of course it's a superb piece. But how has it gotten to be sort of the, the king of this kind of, of composition? You know, it's, I think that's a great question. I've asked myself the same question because I have listened to and loved that for years. In fact, similarly to this Pomp and Pipes recording, that was um, another great inspiration of mine in high school is listening to the Saint-Saëns organ symphony. It's called the organ symphony, not because uh, the whole thing is played by the organ. In fact, the organ plays fairly softly through the first part of the piece um, and until that great C major chord. And <laughs> one of the things that's so stunning about it is just the, Im the really incomparable way that Sassau set up that C major chord, the way that everything comes to rest in, on the dominant of mm -hmm. C major. And it's, it's, um, it's a masterful pacing of energy, and sonority, setting everything up for this grand moment. And I, I don't know of anyone who has ever heard this piece uh, for whom that moment didn't sear itself into their, into their musical memory. Uh, it's, it's just stunning. And so as an organist, how difficult is it to play that C major chord? Not very, you know, it's fairly obvious when to come in. But there's just something, um, you know, it's funny. I was talking with a, a non-musician friend and they said, wow, it must just be a thrill to play that big organ in that space. And I said, yes, I, I think all organists have a bit of megalomania. <laughs> and, and so to play this fortissimo uh, C major chord at that moment in the saint -Saëns organ symphony, it's kind of the pinnacle of that megalomania. <laughs> uh, that, that chance to to bring something to the sonority to the ensemble at that moment that that um, that the ensemble itself cannot create it's just thrilling and C is the lowest note on the pedal board so you get the biggest bass pipes on that exact chord Sassau himself was an organist so he knew he knew exactly what he was doing in the way that he wanted to feature um, that instrument. And in the context of this piece, it's just thrilling. It's a standout uh, among all of his works and all of the works that include organ with the orchestra, or in this case, the wind ensemble. 